Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy Kiwara. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're jumping back into part 17 of our Generation Zero gameplay content stuff. Nah, I'm only kidding, guys. Yeah, so this is our 17th, yeah, 17th part in this playthrough. Um, I'm currently stuck in a uh, convenience store uh, surrounded by all Apocalypse class machines. I've been trying to wait these guys out for a few minutes, but I'm pretty sure it's intended that I actually have to fight these guys. So I'm just going to... Um Oh shit, I forgot they had flamethrowers. Oh my god, this is nuts. That's one. I need to start making some more ammo. I'll take all of that. Dead guy, I'll take all of that. This place is just like crawling with these guys now. Oh, and we managed to have a good find as well. So I was just exploring. I was opening car doors and stuff like that. And there was a... Um, like that. And there was a chest. Not not a chest, sorry. There was a, um, a weapon crate. So I opened that bad boy up. And uh, there was a, it was a level 5, so a legendary uh, 1x4 weapon site. So I'm pretty, pretty chuffed with that. Just the... No, this isn't the hideout. It's in the mountains, isn't it? There we go. Found an emergency shelter. Hopefully we can... Uh... <laughs> you, you start to notice that once you get to the Himfall DLC part of the island, like, oh, sorry, of the map, a lot of... Oh, jeez. A lot of the guys start dropping off... Um... 50 BMG rounds, so if that's not a hint to start using the uh, the 50 cal or the PVG, whatever you want to call it, uh, I don't know what it is, but I really like this, uh, the normal sniper rifle I use, but honestly, it's pretty ineffective now. Awesome, alright, so, that is that, we go this way, what's, what's in here, or is the door busted? What have we got in here? Ammo. I don't know why the guns are so crap. Like, I thought they'd be way better. Shotgun silence. I know we already got a legendary one of those. Alright, and I know I was whinging about finding all those articles of clothing. Turns out, I already, yeah, I just did it before I started recording. I picked up um, a new set of hair or something and it did it. So, um, we got the fas uh, fashionista perk, I'm pretty sure. Oh, sorry. Fashionista uh, Achievement, as it's called. But yeah, guys. So, um, in today's episode, I'm pretty sure we're just we're just going to be running through as many missions as we can um, in no order. Um, if, there's, if I come across a side mission I want to do, I'll just do it. Um, I've already found a few collectibles. I haven't, like, I found their locations. I haven't actually, um, actually taken them yet because that would spoil the video. But, um, but yes, yeah, so it's kind of hard not to take them straight away, but yeah. All right, we're going to explore this little place up here. And then honestly, I might see, because we've got a few safe houses down here, I'm not too bothered. I might make my way down to this hotel where they're actually stationed at. So this is like the main area. This is the main base of the Himfall Resistance. So we're going to go there. We'll get the safe house unlocked. And then I'm going to make my way down to... Where is it? Oh, I'm going to make my way up, sorry. Up to this, back to this low, uh, safe house over here at um, Arklestorp. Because this lighthouse at Arklestorp has the uh, the purple BMG, uh, purple P, PVG. 
uh, so the 50 cal. And honestly, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna need it because uh, these guys are taking way too many bullets. Because at least that uh, I'm pretty sure you might still be able to one shot hunters with the purple PVG, but I'm honestly not too sure. What's that? Mouse are hunting. Blue. Ah, uh, it's crap as for where for uh, damage and rate of fire, so we'll drop that bad boy. Ah, oh, yeah, see, we got the uh, the legendary 1x4 rifle scope. And what did it just give me? I think it just gave me a 4x8. That's not too bad. Alrighty. Um, is this his wedding day or something? He looks really like all fancy and dressed up. It was his wedding day, that kind of sucks. Oh yeah, there's a cultist church, I forgot. Yeah, there's a full on cult down here. So how much further? Bloody hell, it's quite a distance. Yeah, these guys, this is like, this is like the cults, the cultists over here. Yeah, see, they're like, they're like worship the, um, uh, like, is it, I think that's a run ahead. Yeah, these guys are crazy. Probably why they're all dead. But they're armed to the teeth, so I am not complaining. Sure, that's it for in here. Ooh, weapon box. Ah, noise. Alrighty, we can move on. But yeah, nah, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to switch over from the uh, the normal sniper to the uh, the 50, the 50 cal. Because even on tanks, unless or even on um, uh, hunters, unless I'm aiming, unless I've already pierced through their armor plate. Um, the bullets just bounce off. They just ricochet. So it's easier just, um, just using the PVG for the time being. Just until we can get the, uh, start hunting for experimentals, which isn't going to be too far away, because I'm pretty sure we're nearly level 22. Yeah, halfway. Alright, so we made it to the hotel. Uh, Let's go. By the way, guess it goes without saying, bud. We're not exactly safe here. Living in a grand luxury hotel and having to cozy up on the floor of a wine cellar. This guy's an asshole. Ooh, that's a lot of mines. Wasn't bad. Three with one magazine. Hell yeah. The other one's in the kitchen. Alrighty. Let's go see the peeps. Anita, what's up, girl? You made it. Thank you so much for the medication. So this is us. I'm Anita, and as Warboard. you can see, we're not the life. Hey, we got five it. missions, bitches. I'm Let's there. go. Do I look familiar? It's all right. I used to be. 
We'll need to talk about your Barbaro's heyday another time, Mr. Used to be Rockstar. <laughs> oh, do I have to go kill some peoples? I'll be able to one-shot these guys if I'm good. No. You got me poisoned. Like that poison goes for a while. Oh shit, Hansa. Yeah, it's not gonna do shit to a Hansa. Way. And I need my uh, experimental shotgun. Woohoo, look at that. Shame we already had one. I think, I swear to God, I've, I've had like six of these now. Oh, you bastard. Impressive work getting rid of those toasters. The thing is, now they probably know where we are. You, we, gotta fix this. Hmm, maybe. Um, uh, make a lot of noise to lure them away. <laughs> You're a genius, man. The fire alarm in Tan Buddha Scouts. Alrighty, what have you guys got for me down here? He's just getting drunk. He's, he looks like he's stoned. Are these grenades? Holy fuck. Yes, please, Daddy Lakey. And I can't recycle anything. I'm going to take that out. Take like 500 of this out. And then we can recycle some stuff. Put all the thread in, put all the steel in, put the aluminium in, put the tungsten in. Rubber. Wood. I'm just going to ditch the rest of it. There we go. Now we sweet. Alright, so how much have I got? So I've got 1,600 FMJ rounds. There we go, I might make some uh, sandwich wheel. Yeah, about 2,300. We are sorted. So we got a fair few side missions now. So we got what six side missions, one main mission down here, which so we'll is make some noise. So that's probably where we're gonna head to first, and then we'll uh, then we'll jump onto the side missions once we've done that. Take all of those. Alrighty guys, so I'm actually going, this is a bloody nice view. Like, look at that guys. Damn. Um, Alright, so I'm actually going to fast travel back up here. Get that PVG and then we'll head back. Yo, I even made a new video about getting that, um... 
about getting the uh, the fucking whatever you want to call it, the legendary rocket launcher, the M49. And people are still saying it's not there. Like, how many times do I have to say, all you have to do is unlock the warboard, like the mission then unlocks itself, and that's when the, like, the gun will, like the RPG will spawn. Like how, f oh shit. Like how dumb are people? I had some guy calling me like a dog in the comment section, like, oh dog, it's not there, blah, 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 like, are you, are you fucking, are you stupid? It's fucking there, G. Alright. Yep, awesome. So, let's clear that, clear that. Clear that, and clear that. Assign him a slot. Attachments. I don't think I'll have many 50 BMG rounds. I, mean, I think I might actually have to... Um, I think I might have to... Uh, whatchamacallit? Go and find the actual 50 BMG um, round locations. I might actually do that in the next video. How many have we got? FMJ, we want AP, don't we? We'll stick to the FMJ. I'll tell you what, it's a mean looking gun. Really is a mean looking gun. Alright, sorry guys, enough procrastinating. We'll head back over here. This waypoint down there. Let's get going. Can't wait till we get our experimentals back. I still have the um, I still have two experimental shotgun. Oh, sorry, two experimental weapons: the 12k shotgun and the kipist. Um, SMG, and I really just want to start using them because that was like my favorite combo, like the Kipist and then the um, the PVG. Oh, shivers. Yeah, so I might actually once I'm level twenty five, like I think that's I think it's fair game to start using that capist. And there's no point like just having like I've had that experimental just sat in the uh, the plunger the whole time. Like I could have been using it, but I thought like it would be a bit like a bit dodgy. Me just starting the game off with a uh, experimental uh, twelve gauge and SMG. But, um. Oh, and I I might actually start using that shotgun because I got the. Uh, I've got all the legendary gear for it. I'm pretty sure I've got a legendary silencer and choke now. And they've got the uh, the legendary snipe, uh, shotgun scope as well. The one to foresight. Problem is though, this thing makes so much goddamn sound. I'm reluctant to use it because I don't have any freaking ammo for it. I was just about to say they don't know where I am. Nick Minute. No, 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 don't. Good robot doggy. Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Yay! Let's 
It's like a safe house. Is there anything in here? Yes, no, maybe so. Are they trying to get in? Created a choke point. Oh, there's so many. safe. Damn, that was crazy. Hey, Poppy. Can you steal from me, G? Car battery. Well, you guys have got the goods. See, I never collected wood um, in my last playthrough, but like as soon as we got to, um, as soon as we got to like the base building side of things, like we well, just needed so much, so much materials, and it was really hard to find. Like if I had just done it like like right towards the start, which I was meant to, it would have been so much easier. What we got in here? 50 BMG, thank you. More BMGs, let's go. Right, that's sorted. I right, will actually do the mission now. We're getting so many BMG rounds. Take, take, take. Toasters here. It's going to take more noise. Try here, Sir Friedrich. The air raid siren. It's at the top of the Urvertana Fuden Lighthouse. I'm coming, Lighthouse. And these names in Swedish are so hard to pronounce. I have to climb all these damn stairs. Oh, yuck, textiles. I don't want textiles. Oh, Jesus. Is that me? Safe house unlocked. Is that just going to keep playing? That's going to be pretty damn annoying. Alrighty guys, so I'm pretty sure we're going to call it here. It's been like 25 minutes, so uh, good place to call it. Uh, we will continue on with the main missions uh, for the Himfall DLC soon. Well, in the next episode, sorry. Uh, yeah, so if you guys are enjoying, be sure to drop a like and comment subscribe if you guys are enjoying all that kind of stuff and uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next one take it easy peace